going to try and do the cowhide bleaching method on this sweatshirt here. Um, I think it's the uh, Gildan G180. I'm not sure the color. I know it's a heather color, but I'll look it up and put it in the description. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to scrunch it up, but first I'm going to put this on the lid because for some reason on this glass table the shirts don't want to scrunch up very well. So, I'm just going to start scrunching it up. Sweatshirts are a little hard to scrunch. But you're just trying to get it as many little bends in it as possible. Try to do it small. I mean, if you have like a little, a lot of spots that aren't really folded, it's going to get a lot of bleach on it. So you just try to get it scrunched in as much as possible. It's going to be a little hard on this sweatshirt so they don't want to scrunch. Okay, I have my little bleach bottle, and I'm just going to start squirting it back and forth, up and down. Alright, and you're going to scrunch. I have my gloves on. Alright, we're going to flip it over. Scrunch it up again as best you can. Sometimes you might have to open it back up. Make sure your, your sleeves are on the right side. Try to just scrunch it up the best you can. Like I said, these sweatshirts are kind of hard to scrunch, but I think it's my only second time trying to do a sweatshirt, so if you know any tricks, let me know. All right, just up and down. And scrunch. it up. Put the lid out of my way for now. Flip it over. All right. Table probably needs to be bigger than this, but I think I'll be all right. Let's see. All right. You see it's already turning. Ah, ah, ah. Charlotte, quit. Oh, I'm just wiping down my lid so I can get it in my shirt because we're going to trace the center image where the center image will go. Just get it in there. Make sure it's kind of centered. It helps you get your image good. All right. Image, three fingers down from the collar. Try to center it up with the sleeves here. Get your flower. I just swap up my flower because Charlotte ran off with my almond flower. Or I think it was coconut flower. Right, just throw it around. Get a general idea. my glass jar of bleach and then just start doing your outline just put it here in the center so I can get it the sun's coming out good so hopefully this will turn pretty good Go around the outline. I don't think this colors will look good on here. Looks like it's kind of a more copper orange is like the secondary color. Maybe slight pinkish to it. 
I think it'll be good though. I think it'll look cute with the design that I got. And just start filling it in as fast as you can. Looks like this one's turning pretty quick, so it shouldn't take too long. Filling it in. Let me know in the comments any other videos y'all would like. Any questions? I'm a newbie too, so I'm learning. Like I said, it's probably only my second sweatshirt. some cool colors. It's always kind of hard to tell whether or not you've hit it already or not. I may speed through this because I know this may be boring <laughs> for some of y'all. Alright, I think that's good. Well, maybe there's a spot right here. Leaves in the sun. I need a bigger, bigger table, bigger, better table. All right, guys, we're gonna let it sit and get as wide as we want it, and then we'll come back with step two of the cowhide bleach. Okay, guys, I have let it um, sit. It didn't sit very long. I flipped it over uh, to get the back, get it pretty white. And we're just going to go in with the bleach bottle and hit these little spots with the dark still and try to get them to change real quick. And then we'll spray it down with the hose. Let's go ahead and just start picking some spots here. Pouring bleach, scrunch. Again, kind of twisting, folding over, scrunch. All these little dark spots. Where you would want that two-toned color. Try to move pretty fast. This one turns pretty quick. So scrunch. Scrunch. Don't forget your sleeves. Just try to go pretty fast with it. See how fast it's turning one down here, scrunch, scrunch, I think I even got any out just then, okay, get your sleeves, might have to hit it with some peroxide to get it to stop, because it turns pretty fast, this sweater, that shirt's turning pretty good. Alright. That one. And we're going to go ahead and probably flip it over. I need to get that one a little bit more. Have your hose nearby. Yeah, let's flip it over. Don't forget your sleeves. I'm gonna get the front here. Try to get some here at the collar. I think I got bleach in my hair. Trying to go really fast here. Like I said, this one is going, turning super quick. See down here. Get your sleeves. Just 
pouring and scrunching, going really fast. Trying to let it out. Look over here, get this sleeve. Yeah, I think that's pretty good actually. All right, I'm gonna get the hose. Maybe just double check it. A little bit more maybe up here. Oh, I like that two-tone color, so I'll try to get it in there. Some right here. Front. Let's get our hose. Get this down. Dean back there chilling. I don't know if you can see him or not. Oh, the hose don't want to reach. Okay. Her down. And that bleach over there. Flip her over. Oh. Heavy. Oh. So cute though. I love that color. For the Peachy. I'm just soaking it down. All that bleach out. Get it to stop turning. Alright guys. I think that's it. Um, try to wring it out some and bring it in the house and throw it in the wash. Okay guys, uh, this is how the shirt came out. I know I always say this, but it's super cute. Um, kind of has like a camouflage color to it. I think it turned out really good. All right guys, um, please make sure to like and subscribe. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think. I should have this design in my shop soon. Anybody would like to purchase it or the sweatshirt. Just make sure to please like and subscribe. Thank you guys. See you next time.